Hello and welcome to another Motivational Monday. Today we are in my bedroom. I'm going to tackle my end table on my side of the bed. Yeah, it's gotten pretty bad and I'm really tired of it. So I'll just show you what I have here. Um, I have a basket that I think I picked up at Bed Bath & Beyond and I tipped it on its side. And you're probably thinking, why did you do that? And the reason is, is I like books, I like my journals, and instead of having the basket the way that it's supposed to be, like this, I'll end up putting a bunch of junk in it. Um, and I didn't want that to happen. So, I have it on its side so my books and my journals could just be in there and that is where, it, you know. So, yeah, I have had no problem with keeping it clean and um, yeah, it's just stayed clean and junk free. And I could see my books and journals and it makes me go, oh yeah, I wanna read or yes, I want to write in my journal. Um, so I just have, these are just journals, books. So um, anyway, but today we're gonna talk about this drawer right here. Ho, ho, ho. Are you ready? Well, first let me just show you what I did to the bottom drawer. Um, it was full of junk. Oh, let me show you what it looked like before. It's just a junk drawer. So we're going to clear this out. And now what I did was just put all my extra PJs in here. I'm a PJ sweatpants girl. I don't have a dresser for our bedroom yet. We're still looking. I swear, after 17 years of marriage, we're still like the newly married college students with all the Mitch Matt Mitch match furniture um, and so we're hoping to get a dresser in here soon but I don't have much closet space so I thought you know what let's put some of my jammies in here and that will keep the junk from going in so anyway so that is going to be a help so let's talk about the one drawer that is not making me happy here is the before that is a sad sight just things that, when cleaning don't have a home, I guess I've just been thrown in here. That is a Christmas ornament. Yeah, I've got a command hook right here. So I have a lot of stuff that doesn't need to be in this drawer. And it needs to go away. So what I'm going to do is I have a garbage sack here. I'm going to throw away the garbage. I'm going to put piles on my bed to the homes where everything needs to go in. And put them away and then I want to create a lovely drawer that just brings inspiration and just feels good when I open it so I am gonna hurry up and clean this drawer okay here's my bed <laughs> I have little piles everywhere medicine that needs to all go in the bathroom that's the trash that's the office that's my jewelry and I had a pile over here of what I want in my drawer so now everything is in their piles and I can put them away but let's look at the drawer now okay here is my drawer these bins I got at the Dollar Tree forever ago uh, I just shopped my house so starting this project today I didn't have to spend any money these are things I already had in my home if you were to go to the Dollar Tree um, I even think that those come two together um, so it may maybe three four dollars to do this so it fits my drawer perfectly. So now that I want to fill it, I just don't want to put stuff in it to put stuff in it or to make it look pretty. I really want stuff that I'm going to use in here. So if there's only a couple things in here, fine. Because you know eventually it's going to end up getting filled again and I'm going to have to redo it. But hopefully not. But as me, let's get real. Okay, let's fill her up. Okay, here is my drawer. Nothing too snazzy. But it works. Okay. I just put the things that I normally have in my drawer that I go to, that I have to rummage around for. So I have this bin here for my jewelry. When I take them off at night or my hair bands, they go here. Um, and then, I'm not a huge jewelry girl, to tell you the truth. I have earrings that I wear consistently, which are these gold ones. And this is a bracelet that I wear most of the time. So at night, I usually take them off and put them here. Um, here I have tissues floss, lip balm, this right here is um, like massage cream, it helps relax your muscles, so I like having that, and you know, 
<laughs> womanly thing right there. Let's not get into that. But that is there. Here are all my pens um, that I use in highlighting like fine point markers for my scriptures. Um, I used to read on my phone my scriptures, but I miss going back. To, I just miss holding them in my hand and marking them up. So that happens here in the bed. Um, not necessarily in the morning or bedtime, but the bedroom is where I read my scriptures. So um, I have my markers for it. I have my highlighters for my scriptures. And then here is a notebook to write down any thoughts that pop into my head and believe me, thoughts pop into my head. Like to do's or an idea for YouTube. Um, I usually run and grab my planner, but um, sometimes I just don't want to get out of bed. So this is the notebook that I will write down ideas for YouTube or things for the kids that just pop into my head and I don't want to lose them. So I write them in the notebook. Here is the Pursuit of Excellence. It's for women in our church. It just helps me with my scripture study. Um, you learn about like faith and serving others and correlates with scriptures. So I love this. I put this with my scripture study. And this is my gratitude journal. Um, I usually kept it up above, but this is where it's going um, in here. And so there's not much in this drawer, but it's what I need to have in the drawer. And um, I don't need a lot of stuff because I don't want to, you know, clutter it too much. And so this is it guys nothing fancy but it fits my needs and yeah I'm so glad it's done I feel so much better that is me de-junking and organizing my bedroom <laughs> nightstand thanks for joining me I hope this motivates you and really less is more that's a lesson I learned today less is more hope you have a great Monday let me know um, if you end up cleaning out yours and on follow me on Instagram show me a picture I'd love to see it or Twitter, tweet it to me. I would love to see how you, um, if you cleaned it or how you already organized it. I would love to see. It's so fun. I love looking into people's lives and seeing what they do. So, all right. Happy Monday, guys. Hope this motivated you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.